Hey guys, it's Tatiana, and we're so happy you're here today. Yeah. I have my special model here, my little honeybee. Say hi. Hi. Okay, honeybee camera's right there. Remember? <laughs> okay, so we are going to do her beautiful curly hair today, right? What's one of your favorite things you love to do? I love to get your hair done. Yes, I love to get your hair done. <laughs> Because I like it. Because it, like, it, like, it makes you wake up. Yeah, it helps you wake up, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so as you can see, her hair's not done at the moment. Um, I think we washed it like yesterday. She had in some braids, and so we took the braids down. So that's what it looks like. But anybody who has curly hair knows that when you wake up in the morning, chances are your hair is going to look like this, right, honeybee? Mm -hmm. Okay, so. Um, I have a, a cup, honestly, just like a couple of brands that I'm absolutely obsessed with using on her hair, on my hair, um, not only because they have like a lot of natural ingredients, but because they smell yeah. so good, right? Yeah. They smell delicious. <laughs> yeah, they smell like you can eat them. Right? Okay, so one of my favorite, favorite brands is this Mayel Organics. If you can see it here, they have have basically their entire product line for hair. Um, this is a shampoo that we use for her um, and also use a deep conditioner because if you have curly hair, you know how important it is to condition your hair, right? So um, this is the conditioning shampoo and it smells really good. It has like a nice um, fresh mint to it. It gets the hair really, really clean, strips it of, you know, it doesn't um, strip the natural oils but it gets all of that dirt out of your hair and makes it nice and squeaky yes. clean and uh, this is my favorite uh, deep conditioner for her hair I usually just skip regular conditioner and just do deep conditioner let it sit again this one is very minty and it's really good for moisture and repairing your hair but to start because we're not gonna wash her hair right now no. um, <laughs> to start we are going to first detangle. Now the first step that I always do is always wet her hair and detangle it. So let's see. So this is a curl smoothie. Okay, so Mayel has this leave-in conditioner that is absolutely delicious. It's really amazing. It's pomegranate and honey. We always run out of this, yeah. right, honeybee? <laughs> we always run out of this. We always got to get more, but I'll show you. It has a nice mm -hmm. consistency to it. Mm-hmm. It smells like pom it smells like pomegranate honey. Okay, so always have a spray bottle, but I what I wanted to show you, if your hair is a little bit dry, Mayel also has like this rosemary rosemary and mint um strengthening oil. So what you can actually do, a little trick that I do is I get this spray bottle. I just get just like a little bit of this rosemary mint oil. A little goes a long way. Exactly. A little goes a long way. Listen to her. She's a professional over here. So just get a little bit of the oil and add a few drops to your spray bottle. And this particular oil um, is infused with biotin and encourages uh, hair growth. So it's really great, um, but I love to just make sure I use as much or add as much moisture to your hair as possible um, so it doesn't break or dry off. So you put it in there, just kind of shake it up a bit because after all, it is oil and water. <laughs> and basically what we're going to do is just, so turn it on, honeybee. Okay, so you know, just kind of like mist her hair spread her hair all over and so again this has the oil and it has the water mixed into it this one, yeah. so always putting back moisture yeah. in the hair you know because the moisture will help your curls bounce more yeah. right yeah, really, bouncy. Mm -hmm. really really bouncy curls Okay, so after we spray it down, let me find it on here. Um, this is when we start using the leave-in conditioner. Again, this is the... It helps detangle the hair, get all the tangles out. 
And again, it's also moisturizing the hair as well. So again, you don't need that much. If you want, you can also, you know, divide the hair in sections or whatever. I'm not that professional with it. <laughs> I just kind of go, kind of go with it. Um, but I do use an ample amount of this leave-in conditioner because um, it really, it doesn't hurt the hair or anything. Again, this is the pomegranate and honey. It smells so good. It's lightweight. Um, it's fresh. There's also another leave-in conditioner, and I'll show you. It's uh, from Miss Jessie's. And this leave-in conditioner is a new one. Um, that we've only used probably like a couple of times, but I wanted to try something new. And this one has soybean and aloe in it. And again, it's great for detangling, kind of the same type of consistency and texture as Myel Organics. Um, and it goes on easy. It has a, a really, really fresh scent because of the aloe that is in it. So both of these work really good. You don't have to use both. I just wanted to kind of show you. So already you can see her curls are already getting more defined and I haven't even combed it out yet, right, honey bee? Yeah. Kind of just go like this in the world. <laughs> okay, so start combing it out. If you feel like you need more leave-in conditioner, you can always add a little bit more. I try not to like over wet her hair too much. Um, because I don't really want her like going out and it's like super super dripping But um, I can really smell that Miss Jessie's that aloe and the soybean. It smells really really fresh Very clean, but see how easy it was to comb out her hair Very very easy and her hair is just really really soft right now, too Yeah, Okay, turn it on, honeybee. Let me do the other side. So again, it makes it super, super easy. No tangles. She's not fussing. Does it hurt? No. It's only if it's like... Okay. Okay. Then it could hurt, right? All right. So this again was just the Mayel leave-in conditioner and also um, Miss Jessie's leave-in conditioner. So I really put more of Mayel's leave-in conditioner, and then we added in a little bit of Miss Jessie's. But again, that's all we have in here in her hair right now. We sprayed it with the water. Um, we added in some of the rosemary mint oil, which is great to help stimulate growth because it has like biotin in there. But already you can see how like bouncy her curls. Yeah, so her hair looks really fresh. It looks like she's just fresh out the shower. And what we didn't wash it today, but it still looks really fresh and really clean. And let me put just a little bit more leave-in conditioner because I just want to show. It's very, very lightweight. Again, it goes on easy. And it's great for just kind of defining the curls, really defining yeah. her curls. And again, you can see her hair is super, super curly, super bouncy, really, really healthy. And I've actually found that by using, ever since we switched over to using, especially Mayel, um, um, hair products, her hair has become even healthier than it was before. And I really believe it's because of the ingredients that they choose to use in it. So again, we're just detangling her hair we had no issues getting the tangles out very very easy to comb through and like um when you like get up in the morning like, your curls are all dry right. all over the place so like you have to like do it in the morning like after you right but when we put everything. when we put the leave-in conditioner it makes it so much easier right yeah it makes it And turn around one more time. Yeah. 
So very easy to use. Even a five-year-old knows how to use them, right? Mm -hmm. Just got to know the process. So, and like all of this. Mm -hmm. The process, the steps. So again, you can see her very bouncy, very curly, uh, very fresh. Okay, so we're going to do a couple of different things just to kind of show off the different products. Um, I'm going to do one side with Mayel Organics products, and then the other side I'll do with Miss Jessie's. So let me actually have you turn around, honey. I'll turn your back. Okay, so let's just part your hair, put your head back. Do like a quick part so we can show our Mayel products on one side and put your head up. And then we'll do Miss Jessie's on the other side, okay? So, second, let's just put this in a bun real quick. Okay, so this side we are going to use the Mayel Organics. Now Mayel doesn't, I don't really need a lot of different products when I am using Mayel's. It's pretty straightforward. Um, again, the shampoo, the conditioner, we do the leave-in conditioner as well. And then what I love to use is the Curl Smoothie. Let me just pull it up for you. I think I have it should have it I think it's this one but um, again this is again a pomegranate and honey just like the leave-in conditioner and this is the curl smoothie and what I really love about this is that it really helps give like a soft definition um, for the curls and it says it's for thick curly type 4 hair um, but I found that it works on all different types of curl patterns and stuff because my curl pattern is um, much looser than hers and it, it still works really great for defining, finding that nice definition in the hair. And so you can see it's more of like a creamier texture, but yet still smells really good. Okay, this way, honey, way. yeah. So with this, you don't really need to put too much because you don't, <laughs> you don't want um, the hair showing up like all white and stuff yeah, with yeah. too much because it is more like creamier, but I just want to show you how it really helps get that definition. You see how quickly it gives you that definition on the hair. And so again, like her hair is really, really curly, nice, really healthy, bouncy curls, um, but it's easy for it to get frizzy. But with this curl smoothie, it really helps kind of separate the curls, really define the curls. And then just makes it really healthy because especially because she's young too but even like for me like uh i'm not really a big fan of like crunchy curls you know like i never want my curls to be like super hard it's all about just having like this soft natural healthy bouncy curls yeah like if you can mm -hmm. like Yeah, so they're very springy. And so, again, this curl smoothie really helps kind of define those curls, you know. So, again, so it helps maintain the frizz so it's not doesn't get all frizzy or anything like that. Um, and, honestly, she could just wear her hair down like this with just putting in the curl smoothie. And then we do, like, I do, like, one more step I'll show you in a second. But what I'm basically doing is I'm just kind of finger combing this curl smoothie into her hair making sure okay let me turn a little bit just kind of making sure that the product is being evenly spread throughout her hair like, um, of hairstyle Mm -hmm. just be free yeah just be free 
like a bird. Mm -hmm. So you can see again, very fresh, very bouncy. And let's turn to the side so they can see. Turn to this side a little bit. Okay, I just want you to kind of see. It's really helped just speed up the process of doing her hair. And again, um, if you're really concerned about like not, you know, what exactly you're putting in your hair and the chemicals and stuff, this is the reason why I do love my organics because they do use a lot of natural ingredients. Um, and again, like I said, I've seen a lot of um, great hair growth and just just healthier hair ever since I've like personally switched to using this Myel brand. So again, so this was the curl smoothie that we put in her hair. So I got it all throughout the hair. Also, like, um, products. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to prep your like, hair at night. Kind of hold it. But basically, you know, with hair products, you really just kind of want to embrace your hair, you know, and really kind of show your hair in its best light. And so that's what I feel like these products really do. And I feel like with curls, especially when you have super springy curls, it's kind of hard to find that definition without the crunch, you know. And so the curl smoothie and the leave-in conditioner really kind of give you that soft definition of the curls. Now, if you are looking for a little bit more of a stronger hold. I'll get a honeybee. Um, Maya also has this honey and ginger styling gel, yeah. which remember the first time we got this, you said it smelled like what? <laughs> she said it smelled like she said it smelled like soda. <laughs> but yes, and I explained to her it's honey and ginger. Yes, honeybee. So Again, I love this styling gel, especially when we are going to actually do like a really nice hairstyle. Turn here a little bit. A really nice hairstyle on her hair um, because it slicks it down nicely too. It really, again, it reinforces the curl and it doesn't make it crunchy or hard either. And so that's what I really love. With all like curly hair products, I just love to get that definition without the crunch. You know, just keep it soft and keep it smooth, keep it healthy and nice and fresh. And so what I'll actually I do. Okay, let me put it up in points, okay? So. The gel you can add on before you get them in the ponytails. Or actually, I'll just do half of it. Or, you know, you can put it on afterwards too. But, you know, the gel I love to use, again, throughout her hair because it does give me that definition without all the crunch. Again, it keeps us soft. It defines her curls very, very nicely. Comb it out a little bit. And then what did I do with the hair tie? Okay. So put your head a little bit this way. So you see how it really kind of slicked her hair down too, as well, right here, because frizz is no fun. So you can always just, again, just add a little bit at the top. Brush it. You can put your head down a little bit. Okay. Just make it nice and slick again. And then the styling gel really, really holds. It holds the hair in place and really, again, reinforces the curl and makes it really nice. And also, guys, like, I have, like, I think I have, like, whatever, like, air. Sometimes if you, like, if you, like, have, like, something, like, under, 
they have like curls that are like boing or like boing or like, or like <laughs> bouncy whatever bouncy and then you can do it like okay so what i love to do to really kind of you know because she's still a baby girl um slick down her baby hairs um mayao has like this edge control that doesn't flake i actually use it myself it lasts all day and you really just kind of need a little bit tilt your head a little bit mm. you know just kind of put some a little bit on the edges because you know she does love to run around and jump and ride her bike and stuff and so this really kind of just keeps her hair in place and again just really just need just a little bit and put your head to the side a little bit so you can see and awesome. so it really helps it and again it doesn't flake or anything like that so that's why i really really love that edge control and if your hair is like mine then you can use these products that makes it a Okay, so another little trick that I love um, to really kind of lock in that moisture, but also give her hair just that a little bit of shine so that when it dries, um, it just has that nice, healthy glow to it, which is already healthy, but I love to always just kind of enhance things a little bit. Um, and I've actually been using this for years. This is Bio Silk. And when I say you just need like a little bit, like I mean just just a little, little tiny bit um, because it's just such a rich hair serum that you don't need a lot. And again, if you're looking for like those really, really nice, soft, um, bouncy curls, Bio Silk is really, really great for that. Um, I always put it on after the hair gel to really just kind of, you know, again, all about defining the curls, all about the definition, and just kind of keeping the hair smooth and healthy. Turn this way so they can see. Smooth and healthy and fresh and just beautiful. So not many products. Again, if you have curly hair and you don't want to use a lot of products and if you're really concerned about chemicals, let can see this side again because this side is finished. Um, My Organics is really, really great for that. Again, we use the whole product line like all the time, all the time, every day. <laughs> um, and it has really done wonders for her hair. And again, I just really, really love just kind of like the definition, let's show, um, that it really kind of gives her curls. And I feel like it even actually makes her hair even uh more bouncy too so it's even like fun for her to play with it and then we just kind of add in the bio silk hair serum turn your head up at the end to really kind of lock in that moisture it just adds like the finishing touch to it but not only does her hair look great it also smells really good as well what do you think about this side mm. it's like kind of good does it smell kind of good it like smells like all mixed up things mm -hmm. like yeah, it's a lot of different like stuff. Like, I use, like, um... Yeah, that's the gel like we gel use, the honey and, and gel. Okay, so so that this is the My Organic size. So, again, you saw it keeps her hair really healthy, really bouncy. It's defining their curls and very, very soft. Now, on this side, let's turn this side pumpkin. Turn, 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 turn. Okay. You may have to turn a little bit more, like, go to the back. Yeah. Kind of see. So on this side, I want to use more of like the Miss Jessie's um, hair products. Now Miss Jessie's is fairly new to us. We haven't been using Miss Jessie's that long, but I do love all the different options that Miss Jessie has. And so again, always using leave-in conditioner first. So let me find it. Okay, so this is the leave-in conditioner it's called leave-in condish and it's really again for great for styling and prepping your hair um, it makes your hair really soft it says it helps protect your hair um, and again this has soybean and olive in it so again just want to kind of liberally like kind of put through our hair we already kind of put some a little bit earlier but since we're going to style this side now I just want to put a little bit more and okay 
So again, before we do anything, just want to make sure that we comb it out nicely. And again, see, it makes it very, very easy to comb through the curls. Very, very lightweight. How does it smell, pumpkin? It smells like soap. It smells like soap? Yes, it does kind of have that soapy, like fresh, clean scent to it. Very good, pumpkin. Okay. So you can see, sit up straight. I don't know. Turn, turn, turn. Okay, so you can see, again, makes her hair very, very healthy, very fresh, very, very bouncy. Love it. Okay, so Miss Jessie offers um, a lot of different options for your curls. Um, they have, okay, so <laughs> this one I'm actually obsessed with. They have the pillow, the jelly soft curls. Um, they have pillow soft curls. They have multi curl curls, coily custards. Um, so there's a lot. So this is the pillow soft curls. Let me can see it. Um, and it is like a styling lotion. I wonder what that means. So Miss Jessie's actually has a little bit stronger scent than Mayel. Um, but basically, again, the styling lotion really, again, is helping to define the curls. Let's see. So you can see. Maybe turn this way if we can. So face me. Turn this way. Yeah, just put your feet towards me. There you go. So which one are we doing? Yes, the Pillow Soft Curl. So again, so this is a, a styling lotion um, to really kind of help to find the curls and also kind of keep them um, nice and bouncy and fresh you know so you would put the selling lotion on after uh -huh, put this on after your leave-in conditioner um they also have multicultural curls um so if you find yourself which most most of us with curly hair um you know your curls are all over the place a lot of different patterns um so this is what the multicultural curls is for and all of these just have like a thicker kind of lotion um, type of texture to them. So I feel like you don't need a lot. It's not. Like this one's like apple. Like it smells like. Have you smelled anything like it before? Perfume. Like perfume? Yeah, Machessi's is a little bit stronger, but you see it still kind of has that same effect that Mayel was giving us. And again, Machessi uses a lot of natural ingredients as well. Are you okay? Okay. So, and then the other one that I really love that they had um, is this coily custard. And this is really great for like wash and go um, styles. It says it helps like curl shrinkage and all that type of stuff. This one is a little okay. bit thicker. Oh, that one's like clear. Mm hmm. Yeah, this one's clear. The other ones looked more like lotion. Okay, honey, let me put some in your hair. So this is the coily custard. Um, and again, so this is to really kind of prevent your hair from being like really frizzy and just again, reinforcing the curl. So honestly, any one of these three will be really great. I don't think you need all three of them. It really kind of just depends on what you're looking for, maybe your hair texture, but um, basically all three of these really kind of, put your head up a little bit, let me see really do the a really great job of defining the curls and let's see i think i want to try the let's do more of like the coily custard so i think this one's a little bit more lightweight this is the clear one smell it that one smells like nothing smells like nothing yeah well that's good so that means it doesn't have a lot of fragrances in it Fragrances aren't that great for your hair. <laughs> okay, so we're doing just kind of finger combing it through her hair, really trying to get that definition and spread it throughout. And then let's see what else we have. Mm -hmm. So see, look how defined her curls are. Just really bouncy, really fresh. Um, and again, what I really love about Miss Jessie's and Mayel as well is that once it dries, her hair is still going to stay defined. 
and it's not going to be crunchy. It's not going to be hard. Nothing like that. Um, yeah, I'm easy. Okay, so this other gel, which we use it so much, I bought two, and I already <laughs> both of these are are already pretty much empty. This one is empty. Yeah, I feel like they're both pretty empty. Um, but so, so obsessed with it. It, again, it's gel, but it keeps your hair soft. Um, it won't make it crunchy. Um, and it's like really clear, but it does. It just does such an amazing job with, uh, slicking down her hair. And this one smells like. What does it smell like? It smells like gel. Mm -hmm. Okay, face me so I can do your hair right. I don't know if we put enough on the back. We can do the back in a minute. But, um, okay, so we put a little bit of the super, uh, what is it? The, the um, jelly soft one. The jelly soft, yeah. Okay, I just need a little bit more. Hi, Lena. <laughs> Lena said hi. Say hi. Say how are you, Lena? Say hi. She's talking to you in the chat. Yeah. So let's put a little bit more of these jelly soft curls, which are to the side. And again, I really love this because it really slicks down her hair nicely and it's not going to flake later once it dries, um, but it is still going to keep her hair nice and slick keep the definition on her hair as well mm -hmm. okay. it's a little hard to do with you sitting that way sit this way let me see let me get a hair tie i kind of like this hairstyle but your hair's like <laughs> mm -hmm. your hair's real bouncy right now okay so I'm doing the best I can. Normally, she's not facing this way. <laughs> Normally, it's easier. Hold on, honeybee. There we go. Okay. Didn't make your part the straightest, but it's okay. So, with the Miss Jessie's hair, I will say the difference with it from Mayel is that the product is a little bit thicker i could have actually used less product um yeah the i think i do well i have the mayel organic shampoo in the video carousel and that's the shampoo that i love to use in her hair it's nice and fresh and minty um even my husband actually loves to use that shampoo as well um that shampoo is, it does a really good job of like really getting the hair nice and clean. I haven't tried any of Miss Jessie's shampoos yet. Um, for the past year, we've been using the Mayel Organics um, shampoo. What? Okay, so see, this, <laughs> this looks a little funky, but because I have your points a little bit uneven, but see how defined her curls are, really, really bouncy. And it's the same. So this side we did with the Mayel Organics products. And this side we're working on right now has to Miss Jessie's. And again, Miss Jessie's is a little bit thicker than Mayel. Um, so if you want to use less product, I would recommend that. Um, so let's put, let me have you uh, turn around so I could do the back real quick. And then the Pillow Soft Curls, put a little bit more of this pillow soft curls in here again because i really um want to make sure i keep her hair soft throughout the day um not really a big fan of like crunchy curls and so again you just need a little bit really kind of comb through it and you can see you could just finger comb through it even um, because the leave-in conditioner did such a good job of detangling it you really don't need to keep brushing it or anything like that so it keeps it nice and fresh and bouncy so so that's with the pillow soft curls and again i'm going to use a little bit of bio silk on her hair because i really kind of um 
absolutely love this hair serum to really kind of lock in the moisture give it that little bit of added shine and keep your hair moisturized let me see pumpkin so again with the bio silk you don't need a lot with none of these products you really don't need um that much i think the product that i use the most of is the leave-in conditioner because i just feel like you can't you know i feel like you can't get enough of the leave-in conditioner um, but the bio silk I've been using since I was a teenager on my hair and especially when I have my hair curly It's really great. But even when I have my hair straight I also use it too to kind of give me that just that right amount of shine and then let's see And then we just kind of do her edges really quick Just need a little bit Just to kind of reinforce her little baby hairs let me see pumpkin. I have like 10. Mm -hmm. And this is really good because, you know, she's a kid. She loves to run around. And when I just want to keep her hair like in place, you know, I think this does a really good job. And this edge control, it doesn't get all flaky or anything like that. I know a lot of edge controls, they get flaky. So that's why I love this um, Mayel edge control. It's lightweight, you know, um, and you can like the next day you wake up and say you didn't wash your hair. Like it's still not stuck to your hair you know what i mean like it kind of lifts up because it is just kind of lightweight it does the job that's supposed to do you know um and it doesn't get all gunky in your hair or anything like that really really fancy Okay, so there is actually another gel that I have on here that I actually recently discovered, and I do really like it. Um, it's the Kinky Curly uh, Curling Custard. This one is really, now this one, it kind of smells kind of sweet, right? Smells super, super sweet. But so I use this, let me show you here, honey, I'm going to take down your ponytails real quick. Or actually, no, yeah, let me take these down real quick. I just want to kind of show because this coiling custard, curling custard, it really helps. Like, I really love how it slicks her hair down. Um, I will say if you put some of this, like, on your actual curls, it, it will define them nicely, but it's not going to keep them soft. It's going to kind of make it just a little bit crunchy. Um, so with this curling custard, a little bit definitely goes a long way. Yeah. Um, unlike the other products that we use today, like the Jelly Soft Curls, the, the Pillow Soft Curls, all of those will keep your curls nice and soft throughout the day. Um, but this Kinky Curly, it is going to have a little bit, just a, just a little bit of a crunch, not too crunchy. But I do want to say that it's not going to keep it um, super soft. So... That's why I just like to use it to kind of really slick down her hair. Put your head this way. And as my husband calls it, it'll make her hair all juicy. I don't know. <laughs> but I think it does a really, really great job because, you know, especially like with curly hair, when your hair gets like frizzy. What did I do with the blue brush? Pumpkin? Here it is. Your hair gets frizzy throughout the day, and especially her because she actually, um, even just playing around just a little bit, like she sweats a lot in her in her head and her hair and stuff. But when I use this curling custard, even though she's sweating and running around but not the park, her hair still stays in place nicely. So that's why I really love it. But I really try not to put put your head up. Not to put too much on her curls. Again, because I like to keep her curls nice and soft and bouncy Come on, man. so you can see how we got it really really nice and slick and smooth could probably actually even get it even more slick so and then let's just I like like all of this. Like, mm -hmm. can I see like all of this in my head? But I will say the curling custard too. If you ever want to do like you know like those little ringlets, 
little ring with curls. Her hair is really super bouncy, but you know, like the little finger twist. Um, I feel like this curling custard is really, really great for that. It really helps. Turn your head to the side, pumpkin. Now you can see it really helps kind of just keep that curl super defined. So no matter what she's doing throughout the day, it's still going to keep it nice and defined and just the perfect little curly cues. Good. And like, guys, this is like all um, like all like all these sonics and like it like really helps your hair. Gels are like. Mm-hmm. It keeps it in place no matter what you do, no matter how much running and trumping you're doing. It's how many bike rides it still stays in place but i'm just kind of finger twisting so this part of her hair does have um this kinky curly um what is it called curling custard in it um you really just need a little bit i don't know if you noticed but i didn't put more in after the first round um because the more you put in the harder it will be afterwards um but put your head to the side pumpkin the other side so you can see the curls you see um it really helped kind of really just define them keep it in place and then turn the other side pumpkin and then it also really kind of just slicked her hair down really nice as well so this is with the curling custard now there is another product um from Maya. Let me see it. Make sure I put it on here. It is the refresh spray. Hold on, pumpkin. Yes. So, if you have curly hair, you okay. know that. Yes, good job, pumpkin. If you have curly hair, you know, like throughout the day, um, when you first your hair is like nice and fresh, yeah. good to go. Then it's lunchtime, and then after lunchtime, your hair may look a little bit dull, right? And so this is the curl refreshing spray, especially if maybe you have something to do after work or later or whatever, and you really want to kind of just give your give your curls like a refresh. You know how we refresh our face, get a little facial mist? Yeah. This is like that little mist for your hair. So turn around, pumpkin. So her hair is, it's still pretty good. It's still like a little bit wet. We didn't drench it, but it does still have like, you know, a lot of the great product in it because keeping it fresh. But um, throughout the day, like say she's been playing or whatever and her hair gets dry and then yeah, even on the bike. Um, and we just want to give her hair a little bit refresh. Again, just kind of reinforce the curls, get rid of the frizz. Um, this is my Al Organics. And you see it sprays, I don't know if you can see, but it sprays really nicely. And then you just want to kind of just, again, just kind of just run your fingers through it. You don't need a lot. Um, again, this is, so it's like nothing. This is their, turn around, pumpkin. This, it's their pomegranate and honey. And again, so you just, mm -hmm, turn around, pumpkin. So you just mist the hair and you just kind of finger wave through it. And it gives it like that nice little refresh to it. There you see. Very, very nice and fresh and lightweight. Your hair just smells so amazing because we're using so many great products. So, again, if you do want to kind of use a gel, if you feel like maybe the curls might dry a little bit too soft or something, um, I would recommend the styling gel, Myel Styling Gel, because it will hold the curls, but it won't make it crunchy versus... The kinky curly um, curling custard it will make it a little bit crunchy so if you want that extra definition without the crunch this mm -hmm. honey and ginger styling gel which smells amazing turn around pumpkin um really will give you that extra definition that will last throughout the day and so if you want to have your hair out have your hair down it will um I'll do a good job of just really kind of keeping your curls defined so that they don't get too frizzy. So after your curling lotion or your leave-in conditioner, um, your curl smoothie, you just need that, you know, that added extra definition to your own pumpkin. Um, this styling gel, this way, 
um, does a really, really great job, that, especially um, when it's really hot outside, too. I will say that that's when I do kind of add like this little bit um, extra of definition because if it's high, your hair gets frizzy or if it's humid, you know, there's really just kind of, again, reinforces the curls, locks in the curls and makes it really nice and bouncy and fresh. So if you want to use a gel, but you also want to use a hair serum, I recommend putting the gel on first and then putting the hair serum, hair serum on afterwards to really kind of just the hair serum for me is really great to just kind of give you that added shine um in your hair because when your hair is shiny and it's glowing i just really feel like it just makes it look just that much healthier um so again i really love this bio silk so i'm going to put a little bit more bio silk back for hair again i've been using bio silk since i was a teenager probably before I was a teenager. <laughs> Since I was your age, pumpkin. Um, so again, we put this styling gel in it, and then I'm just gonna lock it in with this Bio Silk Hair Serum. Again, because I love the definition, but I just wanna keep her hair soft and smooth for as long as possible. And so this, let me see it. The hair serum also works really great if your hair is dry too. So say, you know, throughout the day, her hair ends up drying, but I still want to add maybe just um, a little bit extra shine. I always just kind of just put a little bit in my hair and you can see it works when your hair is dry as well. So you can use it on wet styles and you can use it on dry styles as well. Okay, so before we go, I just want to run through everything one last time. Um, of all the different products that we did use today. Come on, pumpkin. Okay, so to start off, well, we didn't wash her hair today, yeah. but the shampoo that we always use is mm -hmm. this, this Mayel um, conditioning shampoo. Again, I really love stuff that really conditions the hair, really locks yeah. in that moisture. Also, yeah. That's the deep conditioner. Deep conditioner. <laughs> the deep conditioner now i honestly bypass just regular conditioner always go for the deep conditioner even if i'm not letting it sit for that long i just feel like it does a better job um what i do love about these two products is just how fresh and minty that they um they smell and it just does a really really great job of cleaning the hair um it doesn't strip the natural oils you know it really just kind of helps embrace your hair and I use it personally on my hair, use it on her hair, my husband uses it. So this is like an all around, really, really great shampoo for regards of what type of hair you have, straight, curly, yeah. wavy. It's straight and curly. Mm -hmm. It's a really, really great um, conditioning oil. And I can't pronounce, it's like babasu or something, um, mm -hmm. but it's, it has a babasu oil in it. And I think that's the little secret potion that makes it so special as well as the deep conditioner is a Baba Sue and mint deep conditioner. So we use these faithfully, absolutely obsessed with these two products, really kind of get her hair how I want it without yes. those two products. Now, um, yeah. after we wash her hair immediately, like immediately when we get out the shower, we always do what, pumpkin? The leave-in conditioner. That's the curl smoothie. This is the leave-in conditioner. <laughs> they look very similar. Very, very similar. Yes. So this is the leave-in conditioner. Again, it's my organics. It's uh, the pomegranate and honey. And I really love it because it is, again, it's very moisturizing. And you kind of think of it like a curl primer. No matter what I plan to do for a hair for the day, I cannot do it without this leave-in conditioner. Like, use this like crazy. We go through it like crazy, super, super fast. Um, Miss Jessie's also has a leave-in conditioner that we tried on her hair today as well. It's a little bit thicker, but this one smells really good. This is the yeah. one that you said smells like soap. Um, it has soybean and aloe in it. So it's lightweight, it's fresh, it's clean. It does, again, a really, really great job of detangling the hair instantly. Like, honestly, like, if you saw when I was coming to her hair, we had not one tangle. We put an ample amount of the leave-in conditioner 
on both sides and combed it out without any fuss, without any issues. Yeah. And it really even started the process of really defining her curls. And then so, what's next we have? Well, mm. next we do the, the curl smoothie, which you skipped. I think That's that one's the say. curl smoothie. Uh, I think this so this is the curl smoothie. So this one's a little bit creamier. So after the leave-in conditioner, I always put in the curl smoothie. Um, again, it reinforces defining her curls, making sure that they're not going to be frizzy. Like, it looks very slick. And yeah. Sleek. Yeah. So that's it up. Okay. <laughs> okay. So after the leave-in conditioner, always um, do the curl smoothie again. It gives you that soft definition. So if you want those soft curls, this is a really, really great choice for you. Now, if you were looking to try it on the Miss Jessie side, um, there's a lot of different options. So, hold on, pumpkin. So she has the pillow soft curls, which is this one, which is like a styling lotion. Um, she also has the multicultural curls. And she has, yeah. one second pumpkin, and then she has the coily custard. Now, honestly, I don't think you need all three of these. You really kind of like, you know, pick your poison. You know what I mean? They all pretty much do the same thing. It really just kind of depends on what you're looking for, but they really are just like styling lotions. Um, again, giving you that definition, reinforcing it, um, giving your hair the nutrients that it needs. It has a really, really lot of great, um, ingredients in this and uh, like has no mineral oils, no sulfates, no petroleum. You know, so Miss Jessie does have a lot of great natural ingredients. But again, the quality custard, I think it's really great. I love to use it on her hair. Really great for wash and go styles, you know, so that your hair doesn't get frizzy. You just put um, a good amount, you know, and you can even scrunch and do whatever you got to do, but you don't have to do all that. It really gives you nice definition. The idea behind the multicultural curls is just the idea, you know, that your curl pattern may be a little bit different, uh, depending on what part of your head uh, that is on. But honestly, I feel like if you have curly hair, you know that regardless, your curl pattern is different anyway. You know what I mean? But this is just kind of a way to help make all your curls really cohesive and kind of a little bit streamlined or kind of like synchronized, if you will. Um, and the Pillow Soft Curls, again, it's a styling lotion, great, you know, for that fluffy, soft curl, um, if that's something that you are looking for. Um, with her hair, I kind of rotate which one of these that I put on, just kind of depending on the day, but I really feel like they all do a wonderful job of keeping her hair defined without the crunch. You know, keeping it really nice and smooth and bouncy and curly. Where'd you go? But if you do want a, a gel, I do highly recommend because absolutely obsessed. <laughs> um, and this is pretty much empty. Um, with the Jelly Soft Curls. By jelly? far, this is one of my... Mm -hmm, two Jelly Soft. Um, this is by far one of my favorite, favorite hair gels. Especially... Um, for like super super curly hair um, it doesn't flake goes on easy it stays you know it's just it's just right you know it's just like the perfect gel trust me you get this you may want to get two because you'll be surprised by how how fast you, oh, you go can through get it. three yeah pumpkin, you can get three you might as well get three right you should have got three <laughs> um, but another gel that we actually love to use too and she actually loves using this on her dolls, and I have to yes, hide it from her so she doesn't. Um, is my Yells Honey and Ginger Styling Gel. Um, this one, again, is also another really great gel that we live by. We've actually been using this one longer than Miss Jessie's. I love it for her because she loves how it smells. It smells like... Yeah, it smells like... Um, it smells like, like honey and, and, ginger. and ginger. That's right. Um, again, really fresh, clean, it's lightweight. Again, it does a great job of kind of slicking her hair down. But personally, what I love to use it for is when I want to have her hair out. Um, and I just want to have it just a little bit extra definition. Yeah, like a little, just a little bit extra okay. definition, especially when it's super hot outside or I know she's going to be running around. Um, this 
this right here is golden because it's not going to make it crunchy but it does really kind of define her curls and gives her curls their best life ever right yeah. <laughs> um but another uh oh it's okay you can just leave it right here another one um now it, this if you want just that super super definition um and this is new to us but the kinky curly um curling custard and that's what we kind of put in our hair right here and then actually what we use to do like these little ringlets show the people yeah it's called kinky curly so um this you do my number one thing i i would say about this product less is more definitely less is more you don't need a lot if you end up using a lot you will see that your hair will be very very crunchy um but if you find that right amount it'll have that yeah, hold like without making your hair stiff maybe do like a little bit if you do a lot then your hair gets right crunchy like almost like like carrots so we use a little bit on her curls just to kind of give her like these nice little ringlets if she wants to sit up maybe sit up again <laughs> so show the nice people your beautiful curls um so you just use a little bit i just put it on once and i didn't go back for more you know and you can see it's holding it very nicely very bouncy very very beautiful absolutely obsessed with it um and if you need like an edge control that isn't going to flake that isn't going to make your hair stiff or like stay in your hair too much like the next day um i do recommend this one by mayao organic set up pumpkin and so we did use some a little bit let's go to the side <laughs> we did use a little bit on her little baby hairs as well i use it every day faithfully hair curly straight wet or dry this is really great it holds nicely set up again it holds nicely um again like i said it's not going to flake throughout the day um and it's also it has rosemary and mint in it which are both really great ingredients for your hair um and it says on here that it helps encourage growth as well so i do really love um that they do include rosemary oil in this and i think that's what really kind of reinforces it and makes sure that it does really moisturize your hair and it's not taken away from your hair or anything like that okay and so also um earlier we were talking about um this rosemary mint oil and the way that i love to use it is just very very little bit kind of just adding it to the spray bottle just get a couple of drops, put it in the water, shake it up. Yeah, shake it up, put it in the water, shake it up, mm -hmm. and then spray it on. Yes, exactly, pumpkin, pumpkin, spray it on your hair. So again, another way to kind of moisturize and condition the hair, you know, and keeping it nice and smooth and healthy. And before we go, let's see. And then there's also this refresh spray. Um, yes. Let me pull it up for you. Yes, your refresh spray it has pomegranate and honey. So, you know, if your hair is curly, you know, throughout the day, maybe um, it gets a little bit dried out or doesn't look as fresh. All you just need, turn on pumpkin. You just need like a couple of spritz and kind of just like run your fingers through it and it will instantly kind of just give your hair that little, you know, like that afternoon pickup, you know, to kind of just kind of keep your hair, especially if you like. Kind of just having more of like the wet look a little bit um this refresh spray i feel like definitely kind of helps you with that look and kind of just you know just kind of give you that little pickup and again really help redefining your curls and this one is by my Yao. so this one is really great as well so it, it helps kind of really hold the hair in place again without making it crunchy or hard or anything like that and then that's our bio silk which we talk about this one a few times this one oop, i feel like it's a really great bottle for the price because this will last you a very very long time to be honest you really just need just like a little bit again just put a little bit in your in your hand and just kind of comb it through yes and again, just kind of give it that shine. Again, we're all about reinforcing the definition, giving that shine, keeping it fresh, keeping it healthy, and keeping it glowing.
So we have a lot of products that <laughs> we went through today. Um, and again, another reason why I love these products so much because it does allow for a lot of different versatile um, hairstyles. You can do a lot of different things, a lot of different hairstyles with these products, you know. So these are really great. But um, again, my Yellow Organics and Miss Jessie's are definitely our go-tos um, for curly hair and really kind of defining those curls making sure it has that soft definition without it being crunchy. Also conditioning the hair and giving it the nutrients that it needs to really kind of keep it healthy and glowing. Yeah? Yeah. Do you like your hair? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, thank you guys so much for joining us. For and watching us. Yeah, for watching us and doing her hair. Um, feel free to reach out anytime if you have any questions. But again, all these products that I talked about today, you can find the video carousel below. Check out the pages um, for all different products. Kind of read the reviews. You'll kind of see kind of exactly like what I'm saying. All these products are really good. Again, giving you that soft definition that you need for your curls and giving it the moisture that it needs. Where are you going? Where are you just going to leave me? Hey. All right, guys. Well, we'll talk to you soon. She left me on the last second. Oh, you're back. Oh. Oh, she's gone. She can handle it. All right, guys. We'll see you soon.